Protesters showed up at a Brooklyn store after a video went viral of an employee subduing an accused shoplifter. You can see the employee on top of 47-year-old Jason Rayford at the Met store on Nostrand Avenue on June 7th. Police say Rayford was trying to leave the store with about $150 worth of groceries. The video shows the employee refusing to get up until police arrived. Rayford was arrested and charged with pettit larceny and criminal possession of stolen property. It's reported that the owner of the Met store has fired that employee and suspended the manager. All right, joining me now, civil rights activist, Reverend Kevin McCall. Reverend, welcome back to Chasing News. How are you? Thank you for having me. So I read your press release, Reverend, and, and you, uh, you started talking about Eric Garner and talking about having uh, the police being investigated. Is it too quick today that people jump to immediately talk about civil rights and racism and are ignoring the fact that there are real crimes being committed? It seems to me at the very least you take away from this, the cops were completely professional. Absolutely. Uh, but uh, the reason why I made the connection between Eric Garner, because he used a chokehold and that he shouldn't have done that using a chokehold. Listen, stakes are high right now in the black and brown community. We're dealing with a lot. We're dealing with COVID on our left and we're dealing with police and justice on our right. So people have to be able to understand what are we going through as a people and they have to be able to understand, yes, he did a crime, but he should not have been dealt with in that particular matter of dealing with, and the owner said so. He said it publicly. He was alarmed what transpired, and that's why he fired the employee. That's why he called on the district attorney to drop the charges. He went to the precinct himself when he found out what happened to get him released, and he was released on a disappearance ticket. So this was a step in the right direction to really heal the community in that community, in the clients community, of dealing with the tension that is going on right now across the country. All right. Thanks, Reverend. Thank you.